Well, hello there and good day. Thank you for joining me. I am Frost PDP, and today we're playing Crusader Kings 2 Jade Biz, episode 90. We uh, ransomed a lot of prisons and prisoners in between episodes, so that's nice. We're in position for this war, which I'm going to declare momentarily. I just want to make sure I get the castle started just in case something goes horrifically wrong. You need a castle. It's like, Oprah, you need a castle, and you need a castle, and you need a castle. Okay. I can afford my war. Definitely don't want that fight. Definitely do want that fight. So, declare. Get my dudes off the boats. Get my dudes over here. There's the money that I need so badly. Uh, the King of Scotland has become Greek. Cool. That's a plus. I'm not giving out land because why would I? Oh my god. How do my vassals keep losing these wars? One of these days I'm gonna have to fix this. I think I can put my retinue on full reinforcement again. At least for now. Now some other guy has usurped the title of Africa. Okay. Not running the most stable realm, are we? King of Kazaria is no longer Tataria. And Peasant Revolt. In the middle of Trebzion. Good luck with that, pal. Are you a threat to me? No, I don't care then. Uh, do I have a siege leader? I thought I had a siege leader. I'm gonna check my cancel. Oh yeah, I gotta go through this again? Okay. He wants to surrender.
have to decide what I want to do with this land. I don't think your war's gonna be a thing much longer, buddy. I'm just gonna say that right now. Very would actually be kind of difficult to take. Burgundy would not necessarily. A very would be very easy to take, actually. Let's get these boats. Let's get these guys back up. Oh yeah, I'm way over my demand limit, huh? That's a thing. Can't usurp his title. Six province duchy. Split it up to each. I could split it up to each. Why do you have my kid? really annoying. Okay. Um, yeah, sure, why not? Grant landed title Canarius and Tamdalt. Ardant and Anti Atlas. that dilemma. A very is next. Have I killed these stupid rebels yet? Thank you. Don't 
don't just wait around. March. That's a shame. Can we just do this? I thought we just did this. Castle is finished in Otrar. Baron of Shalder. Shalder, include little titles, good, have fun with that. One child lacks an education focus. She's a slow one. So this guy's a proper, uh, dude, he's a proper iconoclast, that's good. When I eventually mend the schism, that'll be great. Has anything changed here? No, this is just one giant cluster. Your claim on Trent is it. It's the only thing I can declare. gonna have to do. It's a trap. My sheriff and I discussed what we should do about the outlaws and came up with two ideas. Every man and woman who had been harassed by the bandits, including the sheriff, had been told about the leader's skill with the bow. An archer contest might lure him out of his beloved forest. Another option would be to use the disguise to find the villain and bring them to court. Not gonna be a coward. Sure, let's hold an archery contest. Just perfect for an archery contest, the sun hid between the clouds, the small breeze cooled the nervous, and everyone seemed happy. The targets were set and ready. All that was needed now was my signal. This might capture a chance this might not work. The old man. The other contestants and I laughed hard as the old man tried to draw the bow with shaking hands. After several attempts, he finally succeeded. He closed one of his runny eyes and thud it hit the bullseye. Everyone shinned at the ground as the old man defeated his contestants one by one. The poacher we had set up for the trap was nowhere to be seen, so I had to grumpily give the old man his admittedly well-earned prize, a golden arrow. So what? That didn't work. Frustration swept through my veins as the archery contest proved unsuccessful in luring and trapping the elusive poacher. Perhaps you should try something else. Devil in disguise. I removed my beautiful fur-lined cloaks and reluctantly eased myself into peasant stinking clothes. This is really a very bad idea. Now me own Ma wouldn't even recognize me. Yeah, I'm dead. Good. 
the sky is revealed. Uh, I had not even taken one step into the great forest for an arrow burrowed itself in the ground in front of my toes. I froze for a short second before I started struggling to get my sword out of its hiding place. When I finally freed my sword, a man clad in green stood before me. He held the greatest bow I had ever seen with an arrow on a string and aimed at me. Leave, he said, and I obeyed immediately. Behind me, the forest echoed with thunderous laughter. Blast! Uh, in what county? Oh, no. You're an emir. Somehow you're the caliph. Okay, pal. Let me just finish up what I'm doing up here first, okay? Now I'm right to you. I mean, right to you. Don't, don't worry about a thing. There's no possible way that I could just, you know, ignore you totally and still win this war later on. If they did revolt, would it be a great time to take advantage of it? Too bad I'm not in position. We're gonna smash the crap out of them. As long as it should take. This is actually going to take time. And it's going to hurt attrition wise. Over my supply limit, apparently. For some reason, mild winter, yeah. This guy is just taking land like a beast. It's a developed castle, my friend. Well, we'll continue this next episode. I want to thank you all so much for joining me. If you enjoyed this episode, please hit the like and subscribe button. It really does help the channel grow. It lets me know you're watching so I can make more of it. And I really do appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. And as always on this channel, La Paz.